15 K-dramas to watch this summer on Netflix. Summer is coming and you know what that means. More time on your hands, or maybe not. Anyway, with the pandemic still out and about, are you one of the people skipping the beach trips to stay safe at home? If you are, don't worry about spending the summer in misery. Thankfully, we have several K-dramas to keep you company. For our little segment, Reaction Time, I'm gonna beat the summer heat with a good dose of laughter by placing K-drama number 10 at the top of my watch list. Number one, The Uncanny Counter. A noodle restaurant has quite a long line of customers, but what do you think makes it so special? Is it the location, the food, or the peculiar people running it? Join the counters as they attempt to capture evil spirits who have stepped foot in their area. A student becomes part of the demon hunters. While the current counters have their own abilities, such as sensing locations of spirits, reading memories, incredible strength, and healing powers, what will the youngest member bring into the group? It also tackles social issues, such as bullying, and will introduce you to two distinct but equally lovely squads. Now we're patiently waiting for the second season. The counters have their own special powers. Meanwhile, you have the power to give this video a like and maybe hit that subscribe button as well. Thank you. Number two, Sweet Home. A loner moves to a new apartment after his family gets killed in an accident. Strange things start to happen in his new place and in the whole country, posing new challenges for him. When humans begin to transform into monsters, his peaceful life becomes the exact opposite. The thriller drama, based from a webtoon of the same name, showers you with monsters. Special effects, storyline, cast, and production are well thought out. Will this Netflix original, which has received excellent feedback from across the globe, get a second season soon? We certainly hope so. Number three, Run On. A famous sprinter on the national team has no choice but to quit due to some issues. Finding what's next in life for him, he meets a writer who translates subtitles for movies. Run On also tells the story of a sports agent CEO who finds it hard to reach new heights in the company because of her gender. An art major enters her life and proves that abandoned dreams can come to life again. Following the journey of self-love and discovery, Run On is one of those dramas which has little to no overly dramatic scenes. What's in store for you in this romance drama are day-to-day -day lives and realistic takes on relationships, a satisfying slice of life. Number four, Hot Stove League. A baseball team that is more on the losing side is gearing up for an extraordinary season. The youngest head of the management team is extremely passionate. One day, an unlucky general manager enters the scene. Can the baseball team step foot at the championship with an unfortunate manager and a woman with a burning passion? Even if you have no prior knowledge about baseball, Hot Stove League has the magic to pull you in and keep you glued to the screen. The story holds far more than just baseball. It also shows who's in control and how a team faces problem after problem and tries to overcome them every time. Number 5. Vincenzo Song Jin Ki and Ok Tae Kyung in one frame? It doesn't matter how busy we are, we're definitely making time for this drama. The cinematography and plot in addition to the breathtaking visuals made this drama worth watching, also allowing the villains to sometimes steal the show. Also stealing your hearts is none other than Vincenzo Cassano in his sleek suit and head-turning looks. He was adopted at a young age and moved to Italy. After a less than pleasant experience with the mafia, he decides to travel to Korea. How will his previous experience as a mafia consigliere, consigliere. help him in his new endeavors in the country? He comes across a lawyer who stops at nothing to win. Number 6. Mystic Pop-Up Bar Have a drink or two in the small and mysterious outdoor bar run by an ill-tempered woman who has lived for hundreds of years. The prickly woman together with a man who assists her in the bar stumbles upon an innocent part-timer who will be useful in fulfilling the main reason for running the establishment, a place where customers vent out their problems. The employees at Mystic Pop-Up Bar will try to heal their customers' wounds by visiting them in their dreams. 
Mystic Pop-Up Bar is full of laughter, heart, and a whole lot of magic. Audiences will be moved by the stories of the customers, as well as the secrets behind the incredible trio that heals them. Number 7. Do You Like Brahms? Despite her family's disapproval, Song Ah is admitted into the music school of the same university where she previously majored in business. She is overwhelmed by her new university life and lacks the confidence to face it because she is seven years older than her classmates. One day, calmness takes over her when she hears someone playing the piano. This talented pianist started in the field at a young age. When their lives intertwine, will it be better for them or will they be faced with a whole new dilemma? After a tiring day, a simple and warm story awaits you in this drama. So what are you waiting for? Allow the music to soothe your soul. Number 8. Prison Playbook Shocking the whole nation, a well-known baseball player is sentenced to a year in jail. What was his crime? Using excessive force to stop a man from sexually assaulting his sister. He sees his childhood friend, who is also one of his biggest fans, working as a prison guard in this new phase of his life. Different lives, different inmates, but one prison. But don't let that hinder you from watching it. Because Prison Playbook is full of heart and hope, and it's also paired with a good dose of laughter. Number 9. The Guest When their families were murdered by a demon a few years ago, a young psychic, a boy from a religious family, and a detective's daughter met by fate. After 20 years apart, the trio's lives are intertwined once more in order to fight off a strong demon who preys on the vulnerable and has these weak people kill their families and stab themselves in the eye. Spice up your summer with the mystery and horror drama The Guest! Number 10. The Fiery Priest Isn't it more fun when there is a trio involved? We have a Catholic priest who can be sort of rude to others. Hear him throw some snide comments too. Next, a detective who is both talkative and shy. Last but certainly not least, say hello to an intelligent and attractive attorney. This trio is out to join forces and take us on a journey in solving a murder case. Your tummy will ache in a good way. An endless supply of laughter is offered by the Fiery Priest. What's not to like about characters that are both funny and badass, as well as having strong female characters? Number 11. Live! The cops have arrived to catch your interest. One's an aspiring public official who is currently unfortunate in solving cases and getting on the wrong side of his superiors. Then we have a female officer working to combat male chauvinism. Live brings together different police officers who share their struggles and triumphs while working in the force. If it's a drama with Lee Kwon -so, you know it's going to be entertaining. Live shows viewers the path they have to take to get into the force and their never-ending efforts to stay. Number 12. I Hear Your Voice After overcoming poverty and traumatic childhood memories, a brave and materialistic public defender becomes a lawyer. And an innocent prosecutor, her perspective on justice and society jumps to a new level. She then meets a teenager who's slightly familiar, and he has the ability to read other people's thoughts. A team forms as they take on cases with a slim to no chance of success. Number 13, Hello My Twenties. Ding dong! Welcome to Belle Epoque, a home for five young women in their twenties. In French, the name means a beautiful time. Expect unique personalities and problems from each character. We said there were five girls, but for them, they feel like there's a sixth presence living in the house. You don't have to be in your twenties to enjoy this drama. Hello My Twenties, or also known as Age of Youth, tackles on the lives of these young adults trying to cope with their issues, relationships, and friendships. It doesn't end with just one season, this drama has a sequel. Number 14. 
Number 14, My Mister. Two unemployed brothers, one whose wife is having an affair with his boss. Witness the unhappy life of a middle-aged engineer. A chance encounter with a part-timer will shake up his life. This coworker lives in debt and is caring for her sick grandmother. My Mister is a drama that might be a little slower paced for some viewers, but once you're hooked, there's no turning back. My Mister offers you so many feelings. Can you handle them all? Number 15, The Good Detective. Two complete opposites, a righteous and diligent detective and an insensitive detective with a keen eye for detail are partnered together to reopen a case from five years ago. When they examine the files, a discovery of evidence will place one of our detectives in a very difficult situation. Shaking up the justice system, the good detective reveals who the real enemies are. Just in, the good detective is coming back for a second season. It's possible that some of these dramas aren't available in your country. Let's cross our fingers that Netflix will be kind to you and provide you with all of them. What drama are you planning to watch this summer? Let's have a chat in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching, MDLers. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'm your host at Happy Squeak.